This day was a bit different. What started as a normal day's fishing turned into an absolute mission to get to a ledge that pushed us beyond our limits. Because of how intense this was, we're going to move through the first part of this film pretty quick and get to the meat of the story. Oh, oh, oh man! Jesus. He tried to eat your camera! Alright, so we woke up to a visit from our little centipede mate, but we left him alone and no one got stung. Go for the gloves. Hell, yeah. It was going in your glove, man. Soon it was dawn and we were getting our fishing gear ready for the day. We set out to hike around the low line to the first ledge. The tide was still a little high and we had to wade through sections and climb over others. But we got there in time to have a few heavy casts early into the current while the sun was still just coming up. Nothing was hitting heavy so we quickly switched to light tackle to get a few on the board. Mm. What? Oh! <laughs> See the way there's snaking everywhere, bro? After a few hours of very little action, we decided to make our way back to the other side of the island in hopes of more current and more fish. <laughs> the boys were exhausted from the previous day's hiking and casting heavy tackle, so it actually took a good hour of climbing, passing gear, scrambling up and down wet, slippery rocks to make it to a beach where we could regroup. By now, the day was already half over and we were definitely disillusioned. We talked about our options of either going to a ledge we'd fished multiple times on this trip that we knew didn't have that much current, or as a last resort, we could attempt to get to the one part of the island we had yet to explore. From here on out, I'll leave it to the raw footage to tell the rest of the story. I should say that while I may have lost a little bit of the boys' trust, for what comes next. We're still really good mates and we had a laugh about this days later. All right, enjoy the rest of this fish story. You. Yeah. This looks pretty gnarly. So I'm just gonna do it, no rods, no bag. First, to see if we can even do it. I know there's a ledge over there, but can we get to it is the question. Already getting a little bit gnarly here. So steep. Burn a bit of energy, but it will save our collective energy if this is no go. Oh my god, that's dropper. I wish the fish were on. Hopefully, the silo they turn on. Oh, yeah. Dodgy but doable. Or just straight dodgy. Like it's definitely dodgy. <laughs> Not 100% sure on the doable bit yet. You just don't want to begin the cascade of slipping. These rocks look loose too. Like that's, I don't even know how that's staying there. I'm gonna have to try and go the whole way, I think. The boys won't want to come around unless it's a sure thing. I'll take the safest path up here. Yeah, that's, look at that. Okay. Careful, Brooksy. Careful. We can't get around to there, I don't think, from here, although maybe. But we can fish possibly that if we swim across or jump over. Definitely can fish this and I think we can fish that too, which is a high ledge. And we know the current hits here. This is the only tip we've seen on this island that has current. This could be good. I'm going to get back to the boys and I think we're going to do this. Woo! Long way down. This is the mission for the day. Going to be different with all our gear getting up here. No gear, very chill. Gear, not chill. It's a big wall. But you see the height of this? Yeah. That's it. You go up that and you go down to the ledge. It's not this ledge. It's set up like this. If this is that ledge that we're looking at right there, 
there's like this flat in between there, a little ledge here, and then a rock that's separated out here that's a big flat rock, and then another ledge here. And then that goes around in our old ledge here. I think current hits here. Yeah. And this might be tricky to get out to, like it's a little swim or a jump across, but on high tide it might be underwater. There's loose rock at the top, you just have to be careful. It's like death drop. But there's no like clinging climbing. I think if you're careful, it's totally fine. I was running around jumping on them all. Yeah, but you're. <laughs> I know what you're doing. It's you're just saying loose. it's sweet until nice. we get up there and you go, oh, oh. We've fished the other ledge for two days straight. Yeah. We might as well try this. All right, let's go. It's definitely a mission. But it's still Famous last words. Dodgy but doable. Dodgy but doable. Big mission. It's going to be different with a backpacking gear. Eh? You just got to remember my body is different. I'm packing a lot of weight. You're two kilos heavier than me. Yeah, but you're flexible. <clears throat> the further you get up, the more shaly the rock is. So just be careful further up what you put your hand on. Come on, man. Just remember, dodgy but doable. Yeah, but... I can come up here, Ross. Oh. No. I don't know, bro. I don't know if I can do that. And this is like flat under here. If there was no cliff right there, you wouldn't even trip. Like, if we were going down to sand just here, you'd be fine. Maybe chuck us your odds here, and I'll just do that bit a couple times. This is the worst part, for sure. I don't believe you. <laughs> so, I'm going to back down. If you slip, we fall together. Yeah. yeah grippy shoes, bro. You're good. <laughs> yep. No, nah, not in there. Two feet same side, I reckon. And lean over to the right a bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here come. Good grip. There's no grip. <laughs> Drop your foot down to me if you want. But where am I? You're fine, bro. Oh. Yeah, you're good. Hand where your foot was. Where? That's it. Now what? Now, foot down, if you can. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming, bit more, bit more, bit more. Left foot an inch lower, squat down. Squat all the way down. Lean into the cave. You're good. This foot here. You're good. <laughs> Man. It's proper. He's sweat. Do you want to give us back, bro? Oh. Drop. Do you want me to hold or are you good? Foot down here. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. There's a little foot there. Really strong on your left hand. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. Can you come more? Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. Now you're locked in. There. You got that? Yeah. Right. Squat down. I got nothing to hold on to. Um, Fishing with Briggsy, man. Look like a 50 meter drop. Okay, give me a sec, give me a sec. I'll, I'll kind of hold you and you squat down. Full squat. Ah, uh, switch it that way, yep. And then you're just walking across this with that left hand guiding you for as long as possible to kind of get your foot to here, like that kind of monkey style. Are you alright, bro? That's <laughs> pretty difficult. You got this. Yeah. Is there another way? Down, but it's water now. Or over the entire top. How much more like that is there? None. Don't lie to me. That was the only death climb. And I didn't even know it was a death climb because I didn't look down at that bit. I just went up. I'm not going over there again. I think the boys think that it felt like they nearly died just then. Briggsy's been rock climbing, bro. Yeah, Briggsy's a rock climber. Yeah. I'm off you. <laughs> I'm just sussing it. I can't remember where I went. Might have been here. Yeah, it's here. Are you feeling confident there? You want me to take your odds? No, I'm not confident at all. 
like, how do I get over here? Give us a sack, I'll, I'll grab them. Give us your backpack as well. Oh, I can't get it off here. Okay. Oh, I can't even get my foot there then. So see where that's dirt down there? Yeah. And then this rock's chilled. Huh. I just jumped. Oh, I can't. Okay, sit, sit down on your bum. You good, Nigel? Yep. You want rock pass? These next few steps are real uh, solid. Are you right? I have to stop man, my legs are cramping again. So over there is just easy now. It's not easy. Bro, seriously, don't do that. We'll be fine. My body is not capable of what your body's up into. Your mindset is also different because you climb all the time. I'm sorry. I didn't think it would be that gnarly. No one got hurt. Yeah, but the point is my legs are not stable. Yeah. I can't rely on them. So... Well, if it gets to the point where you're, like, done, I can do backpacks and then you just... Climb but even up. my body weight. Nah, you'll be alright, like body weight. Right, where are we going? Up this. Do you want me to go first? <sighs> yeah. This, this you can chill, actually, if you want. I can get a, a berry on it. I think there's one little bit here with loose and then see those hard rocks then it's on that and it's like solid. climbing down but solid i said is there climbing you said no 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 like psycho climbing uh, briggsy give me a sec just put in rods down You could you could even go down here if you wanted. But why don't I go here, big foothold, and you can get past that bit. Oh give us your backpack, it'll make it so much easier. Where am I going? And then up. But where do I put my hands? In the crib. And then reaching up. On here? I can't. My leg went. Anywhere. Straight up. Oh. Chill this, bro. And then send it out that way. Chuck is your odds, bro. <gasps> cave. Did you hear that? Big cave. That's it. And then foot. Uh, I should be right. I don't know what's down there, but I think the shaley psychoness is over. Oh yeah, we got a bit of a rod pass here. But after this, it looks pretty chill. That was an absolute mission to get here. 
I don't know if John's my friend anymore. Because <laughs> I said it was okay. It was kind of okay. Briggsy's just taking us on a perilous journey and he reckons that this ledge is going to fire so we'll see if it's worth it. Bloody bit of it. I'm throwing a rogue for pelagics. Yeah. Would Brooksy, does Brooksy like, like climbing? He would have actually fought me. Fought you? Fought. Yeah. 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 Nah, he hates death triangles. Yeah. yeah. Manny on the way down, or once he got here, he would have just like. What, cause of the, how frazzled? Frazzled. Yeah. <laughs> You're sweet, bro. All right, current is about an hour or two hours off starting. I'm gonna chuck around this little Minion 80F prawn color and see if we can't hook up in the meantime. It's a really quiet day. The moon phase isn't too great. We spent most of the day just having a bit of fun rock climbing and stuff. No takers. But yeah, let's see, let's see what's out there in the meantime while we wait for the current to start. Spent most of the day just hiking to this psycho ledge hopefully it is actually a psycho ledge and cancels out some of the bad moon phase that we've got going at the moment unfortunately the weather was not good on the good moon phase and now this is the bad moon phase and the weather is good so gotta do what you gotta do for the crew i'm assuming this is just death slip absolute death slip Did you see that? I don't know if I can reverse it, but it's kind of a ride. That was wild. Are you coming? Big dog. Actually, you could probably jump back and pass rods. Here, give us a go. I'll just test it real quick. Do you reckon that's a... That was dry though, wasn't it? Yeah, Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, that's sweet. I'm gonna do a time lapse with that boat. And it looks sick, eh? Like just spinning there with that cruising by. I'm gonna cast light for the foreseeable future. We're waiting for the current to start. Not much happening, it's dead high tide. And there's a ship in the background, so I thought it'd be a cool time lapse to be casting with the ship cruising by. Big shit. Island size shit. Pound leader, long tail. Micro yeah. upgraded hooks. Yeah. Gonna try and turn him here, boys. Zero turn was hard. Oh.
don't grab the leader, okay? Maybe just bring them inside here, eh? Bro, if you can bring them to that corner, you can land them there, yeah. You get down there? Yeah, sweet. It might be a while, boys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get a shot here, bro. It's kind of coming up a bit. Up a bit. Right. I'll get down there. This is an 8-pound setup, 20-pound leader, micro, molossy, lure. You might get a shot here, bro. I hope nothing breaks. It's just so psycho. That's a good longy, bro. Oh, yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, bro. Oh no, bro. That's all right. Um. Can it? All right. Bro. Okay, here, come back, come back, come back. If we get this, this is a miracle. this leader can take out. Eh? Starting to pump him up here. He's deeper this time, bro. Don't know. Oh, yeah, I am getting him up. Come here. Might be the chance here, boys. Nah, just the, just the water release. 
Okay, this is it, man. I'm a bit tighter, so hopefully I can bring him to you. I don't think I can go any tighter than this, though. This is the shot. This is the shot, man. Kylan, hold it! I got him, bro. I got him. Yes! Oh, just water release on this. Can you keep him in the water? No, I got him, man. He's all good. How did you get over there, bro? Just jumped in. Swim over. Oh, swim? Yeah. Okay. Probably bring him over, man. Oh, what a beautiful fish, man. Eight pounds! <laughs> Eight pounds! Yeah, bro. Oh, we might need D hookers. We might need D hookers, bro. Can you chuck them? On the micro molossi. No way, bro. He swallowed it. He'll die, man. Yep. Okay. Can you take that? I'm probably so tangled, bro. Let's just say, let's just say. I don't know, man. It's a shamey. Yeah, I think it's good. Oh, there's a little kick, so. Yeah. Maybe I'll just chill for a minute and. Yeah, yeah. Cause he's, oh yeah, he's doing little. My knees are getting so smart. Gonna sit up here, oh, it's all right. Are you checking at all? Nah, I haven't felt anything. Nah, I think that's it, man. Yeah. Thank you, Mr. Journey. We tried to revive him, but tiny setup, long fight. Are we just teabagging in box jelly water <laughs> for like 10 minutes? <laughs> All right, we're gonna eat this guy's sashimi right now. Big lunch. Smash as much as we can. Thank you, Mr. Longtail. That was an amazing fight. Woo! Psycho battle, bro. That was a wild fight. Wild fight, man. Give it a how we. I'm gonna jump over. Oh yeah. Yes. Oh. What was that? Was that a shark? <laughs> oh. Easier said than done, no. Slippy, slippy. That was mental, bro. That was mental. <laughs> Leader is peppered. Sight cast. Yeah, it was right there. One. Woo! One, two, three. Perfect. Football. Thank you. Phew! Oh, the mission paid off, bro. Yeah, that was cool. That was probably one of the best fights of my life. Oh, get my first work. That's as fresh as it gets right there, man. Primo. I chose this fish over my friend. <laughs> <laughs> The fish and my friend died. I put my th pa friend through. I lost a sponsor for this fish. <laughs> Kicked off my lossy for a long time. Yeah. He will never trust me again. With a picture of me like clinging to the rock. <laughs> and then a big picture of you adding sashimi dangling in, <laughs> in your mouth. <laughs> hey, look at that, bro. Yeah. Look at that. Now just run that filling knife over it. Oh, yeah. Go in at like the first one for a grip. The boy's on here. Yeah. Fruity. Bit of rock involved on your knife. 
Oh, look at that, man. Bro. All right. Cheers. Cheers, bro. Thank you, Mr. Tuny. How is it? Mm. Oh, my God. Really good. Possibly well, slice. You just perched it there. Perch what? On a cliff. Oh, I didn't even know. <laughs> oh, you got choppies. I wasn't using poo hand that whole time. Oh, I don't care. Man. You realise that those four pieces are like a million dollars at a sashimi restaurant? Yeah. Good. A bit of salt water wouldn't go astray, eh? Yeah. Man, I might even do that, eh? You got a little lid? A little box lid. That's high level ledge lording, isn't it? <sighs> yeah. I'm dousing it in some salt water. I don't know how much came up. And then, oh, that, oh. You don't want that much? Oh, it's more in the dipper. Oh, the dipper. That's fine. It's been doused. <laughs> Different? Yeah, better. Different. More fishy. Oceany. Yeah. Do you want to hand feed it? Yeah. With the pole cam? Yeah. Sharky. You let me know if you see him, eh? Yep. Very full. We're gonna see if a shark will come up and have the rest of it for us. I might do a slap. Oh man. Might need to go around Oh here it comes. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you're on it. You're both on it. Oh, you got it. You got it, bro. Oh, oh, oh. oh man. Jesus. He tried to eat your camera. Oh, that's a bully. That's a bully. Is that one a... Bro, I'm... <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, you got it, brother, you got it! Oh, that scared me, that one scared me, man. That one scared me. Oh my God. Do you want to go for a swim to the next little zone, boys? Oh, yeah. What's up? What's the plan? Up to you guys. I don't know. It's about two hours a lot. This is a good ledge. It's just, do we want to leave at night time? What do you think, Nico? I'll suss this way. Might be able to make our way down here, eh? Full cave. It's not too slippy down here. This seems okay. Cavey. Cavey would definitely go this cave. How far is that? You'd properly get smoked if you cooked it. Oh, what about this? Cavey? Oh, tippy toes. I don't know if the boys are gonna love that one, but that's definitely doable. That's all they need is doable. The height thing is what really gets to them. So I'm trying not to lose friends here. I'm trying to maintain the friendship that I have with the Morsi brothers by not sending them on too psycho with mission. Land-based fishing is a lot of this. I don't usually show much of this because, well, it's not fishing, but this is a big part of the type of fishing that I do and my mates do. That we don't usually show, but this film's got some of it in it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you like to see this kind of stuff. I can include more of it. I'm um, not sure about this bit here. It's easy to come back up, but going down that looks a bit Niles Barkley. We'll give it a go. 
sick little hidden cove. No one in the whole world has ever been on this. I guarantee you that. The absolute mission that it was to get to where we are. Oh, it's so soft. They're round coral. That feels so nice though. So. Uh, oh wow. Yeah, that's a swim back. That's a big swim back, boys. It's like a 70 meter swim. Not sure if we can go that way back. The boys are refusing to go the way we came. John especially did not appreciate that whole situation. I don't think he's gonna love this either. Swimming 70 meters in shark territory, not ideal. Maybe I'll let them watch this clip and they can review the mission. All right, I'll teleport back to the zone and we'll discuss further how we're gonna get out of here. I'm just trying to work out if we can go that way, but it looks like you could scramble over the rocks to there, that'd be so slippery. If you could get up to that crevice, you might be able to make your way along a bit. But then there's these big guts like this, so I think, I think that's actually probably a no-go. Eh? Boys might just have to go back up Death Mountain. All right, so the boys are gonna go for the swim, the long way. Briggsy gonna carry the gear out over Death Mountain. So we're splitting, splitting the team. I'm just having a couple extra casts and they're gonna head home. I've kept my friendship. John's swimming back. It's either <laughs> go sketchy. I don't know how many meters up there that is. Look at that, bring man. around I'm like a lunatic with no climbing experience. This guy here loves rock climbing for a hobby. <laughs> or yeah. swim with the bullies. Swim with the bullies, keep the friendship. I'm Mate, down. You've put me in a very, very special predicament. It's all good, bro. You. I love you. That's the second <laughs> This is the way it goes, mate. When you take a fat, overweight dude that's been just working in the garage for like... <laughs> you look funny with your tucked in shirt, too. last two years and put him on a rock. What do you, what do you expect to happen? Uh, what do you expect, Arthur? <laughs> Love you, bruh. No, I was like, what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap the heavies together. I think there is three heavies and the lights together. I think there's six lights. So we go six lights, three heavies. That sounds good. You all right? Uh, no, I think we're gonna bar the cave. What does that mean? Oh, okay, okay, cool. <laughs> I'm just doing everything up real tight, real good. I'll get all these rods tied up and I can take the rods and one backpack up to a spot and then come back down for the other rods and the other backpack and take that up to a spot. So I'll do it in as a system. I won't film too much of it because you've probably already seen all of that on the way down. But if we do make it to this other ledge, we got about an hour of light. I don't think we're gonna. I think this might be the end. But I'll just film a few bits just in case we run with one rod over to there and have a couple of casts at the end of the day. The bit we need to get to is there. Not there, because we can't. But we might rest there. Why don't we get to there and then go? You reached it? Yep. Okay. 
think we made it. Try my spirit in that cleft, man. Yeah. <laughs> Three, two, one. <sighs> yeah, thanks. Briggsy, hope you're alright brother, a long way up, oh, oh bruh, we swam around that point there, but Briggsy is, I mean that looks chill, looking at that I was like yeah that'd be sweet, but getting over the other side is um, Nah, it wasn't my favourite thing to do, to be honest. Now I'm just waiting for the man to appear. He was adamant he wanted to go over the top again. Um, yes! Yes! I see him! There he is! Woo! <laughs> you! I was getting a bit worried about you there, bro. Oh, it's so hard going up. It took ages to get up. Up that bit? Yeah, just like stop, put the rods down, go that one little bit. Yeah. Have we got time to go fishing? Let's go, let's go. I reckon we got straight there. Yep.